Hi guys, my name is Muhammad Shehzad and today we are going to uh, do another video regarding the vulnerability scanning and it says we are going to scan SQL 2019 server, yes, and it's a part of uh, our always on. So first of all, I would like to ask a new guys, if you are new on my channel, kindly do not forget to subscribe my channel and hit the bell icon so you will be notified with the new upcoming videos okay guys so let's start our video today so we are going to scan our sql server so i will go on my vcenter and i will show you that we have uh, installed nasus before if somebody uh, didn't saw that video the nasus installation uh, you can go back on my list video list and uh, you can check how we can install a nasus so secondly during our uh, SQL lectures, we have installed always on uh, here two nodes. So I will choose this one first node. It's uh, 100.91, and uh, our this is a SQL server. If you see, I have opened this, and I if you want to see SQL configuration manager, and you can see our SQL is running on this node. So here we go. So SQL is running here, and uh, we will start scanning the ip address is uh, 100.91 so this is the uh, 91 ip address for this uh, server and it's a primary replica now in always on that's why it's took over all the other uh, virtual and uh, cluster ips here so let's go and uh, check if we can reach from this node to our uh, vulnerability scanner and if you see our nasa scanner ip address is 100.52 is here so i will open that this device uh, this ip address in my browser so you know we always open with https double a colon slash slash 192.168.100.52 and you remember our ports double eight three four and hit enter After hitting, it will give you a prompt. Uh, it will give you a login because my login and credentials are safe. This is my uh, machine. So we have some old scannings here. If you see, last time we scanned the uh, ESXi and then switches, Windows 10, Windows 7, Windows 12. We scanned. So we'll create another folder here, new folder and uh, new scan. Uh, you, we will create a one folder. Sorry, here new folder, and we'll call it SQL2019 and create and here we go here we have a new sql scanning uh, folder so we will create a new scan in the new scan i will go into uh, advanced scan click on that okay so here we go we will give a name uh, sql 2019 server Scanning SQL Server 2019 and the IP address you have to give 192.168.100.91 remember the IP address of our SQL Server okay here is, here is all good and we'll go in credentials and in credentials we will say ask this is a Windows machine and in Windows we have a password so I will go for administrator and the username and password is our this one and our domain name is dc19.local okay so this is the dc19.local we gave a password and administrator account the windows administrator account okay and third we will go and choose the plugins so in the plugins we will come back and we will choose uh, microsoft windows here we go we have a microsoft windows the all plugins 4529 files it will come here so let's see if they have a separate microsoft sql no there is not in the because this is a essential uh, nasus essential so for professional we need a license uh, so in the professional edition you can also use cas benchmark okay so all this is done so we will go and check uh, according to this i will come back here and i will save and it will create our uh, scanning under this folder the new scan 
so right now uh, scanning uh, new scan is ready uh, and we will hit the play button here so i will click and launch so it is scheduled and it's started now so right now what i will do i will pause my video because it will take a little time to complete the all uh, scanning on the sql server and when it's uh, completed i will come back and we will continue okay guys so we can see our job is completed and if we see and little bit explore this one this one was a uh, windows uh, 2019 and the sql server is also installed 2019 so if you see we have uh, vulnerabilities uh, there is uh, critical 11 and uh, high is 10 and uh, medium is uh, 15 and other one 177 is informatic so let's click on here and we can see there is a uh, fresh player critical security updates dot net framework remaining and uh, we have to go on the website and download the patches and uh, security patches for dot uh, net framework and then it will good to go so these are the packages is telling uh, to we have to install uh, this is the KB file, so you can go on Microsoft and download and install on your uh, uh, server. So it's related to that. So I will go back and then we have some uh, SSL multi issues and there is some other. So we can see more criticals in the flash. What is there is three critical flash adopt player related and Microsoft Windows related. Two is critical like the 10 version 192 that is so this one is another critical thing we have to uh, take the update for this uh, so this one is the kb solution is if you install this one so this one will also go out so this is the way we can uh, you know fix our vulnerabilities on the server it's a sql server 2019 and also the some uh, it's a server also 2019 so see there is a lot of other informatic uh, uh, things related to sql also databases are uh, detected and if we go see the nessus has detected one or more install of microsoft sql server by examining the registry and file server to the remote host solution ensure the latest service pack is installed on this sql server and if we go on more so we have more SQL related uh, things here. See, so SQL uh, NetBIOS multi IP addressing and uh, listener detector. See, we have uh, like uh, SQL server TCP listener detect, uh, detection. The remote host is running a, a MS SQL a database server from Microsoft. It is possible to extract the version number and the installation of the server. So solution is strict access to the database to allowed IPs only. So we have to put the allowed IPs to the database only to the connector. So these are the all vulnerabilities we have to uh, fix one by one regarding the Microsoft SQL. So see all the SQL rated is here. Management Studio is also installed and then uh, desktop, remote desktop connection installed. We have to uh, read that all things. So these are the vulnerabilities which Nessus gave us. So um, you have to clean one by one and then it will be full green. So after full green, we are good to go. So this was the video related to 2019 server scanning on uh, Nessus and uh, our SQL scanning. So we did it. Hopefully you guys like my video and uh, thank you till the next video. Bye. Don't forget to subscribe my channel as well.